Imagine a country where rainfall is so rare that it averages less than 200 millimeters per year. Yet amidst the vast desert, green spaces are emerging. The United Arab Emirates is pushing the boundaries of innovation with cutting-edge cloud seeding technology, a bold step to tackle the urgent challenge of water scarcity. With over $20 million invested in this technology, the UAE has seen a significant increase in rainfall, up to 35% in some regions. Meanwhile, advancements like hydroponics and vertical farming are transforming agriculture, using less water to feed a rapidly growing population. But with such large-scale interventions, could there be hidden consequences waiting to unfold? In the heart of the Middle East, where vast deserts stretch endlessly, water scarcity and desertification pose significant threats to sustainability. The United Arab Emirates, one of the most water-stressed nations on Earth, faces particularly dire challenges. With less than 200 millimeters of rainfall annually, the UAE relies heavily on energy-intensive desalination to meet water demands. However, as the climate crisis intensifies, traditional methods are no longer sufficient to secure the nation's future. Desertification, affecting nearly 80% of the UAE's land, has resulted in degraded ecosystems and threatens the country's ability to support its growing population. Historically, the UAE has attempted to combat these environmental issues by launching various afforestation initiatives, planting resilient tree species in an effort to green its barren landscapes. One notable project, introduced decades ago, aimed to plant millions of trees to reclaim the land from the encroaching desert. However, as the challenges of climate change escalate, innovative solutions are now required to combat both water scarcity and land degradation. In recent years, the UAE has taken bold steps to address these threats with advanced technologies like cloud seeding. This method, introduced in the early 2000s, seeks to enhance rainfall by releasing salt particles into clouds, encouraging the formation of raindrops. The government has invested millions into this research, conducting thousands of cloud seeding operations annually. These efforts are vital as the region faces a projected 50% decline in water availability per capita by 2050. Despite these advancements, the UAE recognizes that much more must be done to secure its future. Afforestation projects, combined with cutting-edge weather modification techniques, have become central to the UAE's strategy to halt desertification and promote environmental sustainability. But how exactly do cloud seeding and other innovative technologies work to combat these pressing environmental challenges? The process of cloud seeding begins with continuous monitoring of the atmosphere through a network of over 110 weather stations, Doppler radars, and satellite imagery that track cloud formation, wind speeds, and moisture levels across the country. When forecasters identify clouds with potential for precipitation, Aircraft equipped with flares filled with a salt compound are dispatched to those locations. These flares are released into the cloud base, where they stimulate the growth of water droplets, leading to enhanced rainfall. In addition to the traditional aircraft-based operations, the UAE has incorporated drone technology into its cloud seeding efforts. These drones are fitted with electric charge emitters that stimulate precipitation by releasing electric charges into the atmosphere. This innovative approach is particularly effective in the UAE's arid regions, where natural condensation processes are often inadequate to produce significant rainfall. The introduction of electric charges promotes the collision of water molecules within clouds, helping them coalesce into larger droplets that eventually fall as rain. Cloud seeding missions are highly coordinated and conducted with precision to maximize their effectiveness. Once the salt flares are released into the clouds, the process of condensation begins, with the salt particles serving as nucleation points for the water droplets to form. The droplets grow in size and eventually fall to the ground as rain. This method has been shown to increase rainfall by up to 30 to 35% in clear atmospheres and 10 to 15% in more humid conditions. The impact of these operations is critical, as the UAE's annual rainfall is less than 200 millimeters, a stark contrast to cities like London, which receives more than 1,000 millimeters per year. The cloud seeding program is part of a broader strategy to ensure water security for the UAE's growing population and industrial sectors. As part of the UAE Research Program for Rain Enhancement Science, the government has funded projects that focus on developing new seeding materials, improving cloud microphysics models, and enhancing weather forecasting accuracy. These efforts have been supported by collaborations with leading international research institutions, which have helped the UAE push the boundaries of cloud seeding science. 
The infrastructure supporting these cloud seeding operations is vast and sophisticated. The NCM monitors meteorological data from its weather stations every 15 minutes, providing real-time updates on atmospheric conditions. This data is analyzed alongside satellite imagery to pinpoint the most suitable clouds for seeding. The precision of these operations is critical to their success, as deploying cloud seeding materials under suboptimal conditions can result in minimal rainfall or even negative environmental impacts. Beyond cloud seeding, the UAE is investing heavily in sustainable agriculture and water conservation strategies to complement its rainfall enhancement efforts. Given the country's harsh desert climate and limited arable land, traditional farming methods are not viable. To address this, the UAE has adopted innovative agricultural techniques such as hydroponics, vertical farming, and aquaponics, all of which use significantly less water than conventional farming methods. These technologies allow crops to be grown in controlled environments with precise water and nutrient delivery systems, drastically reducing water consumption while maximizing yields. Hydroponics in particular has become a game-changer for agriculture in the UAE. This technique involves growing plants without soil, using nutrient-rich water solutions instead. The water is recirculated within the system, minimizing waste and ensuring that plants receive the exact amount of water they need to thrive. Vertical farming, where crops are grown in stacked layers, has also gained traction as a space-efficient solution to the UAE's limited land resources. These farms can produce large quantities of food in a relatively small footprint, using less water and energy than traditional farms. Aquaponics integrates fish farming with hydroponics, creating a closed-loop system where the waste produced by fish provides essential nutrients for plants, and the plants help filter and clean the water for the fish. This symbiotic relationship allows for the efficient production of both crops and fish, further supporting the UAE's goal of enhancing food security through sustainable practices. In addition to these innovative farming techniques, the UAE has also made strides in renewable energy integration within the agricultural sector. Solar panels are increasingly being used to power irrigation systems and greenhouses, reducing the reliance on fossil fuels and lowering the carbon footprint of food production. Solar desalination is another promising technology being explored to address the country's water scarcity. By harnessing solar energy to power desalination plants, the UAE can convert seawater into fresh water in a more environmentally friendly manner. Despite the progress made through cloud seeding and sustainable agricultural practices, the UAE faces significant challenges in its efforts to combat water scarcity and desertification. One of the most pressing issues is the environmental impact of cloud seeding itself. While cloud seeding has been effective in increasing rainfall, the long-term consequences of releasing large quantities of salts and other chemicals into the atmosphere are still not fully understood. Critics have raised concerns about the potential for these substances to contaminate soil and water sources, posing risks to ecosystems and human health. Another challenge lies in the potential for flooding caused by excessive rainfall. While cloud seeding aims to increase rainfall in targeted areas, it can sometimes lead to unintended consequences such as flash floods in regions with inadequate drainage infrastructure. The UAE experienced severe flooding in 2020, with urban areas like Dubai suffering significant damage. Though officials denied that cloud seeding was the cause, the incident highlighted the need for better urban planning and infrastructure development to manage the risks associated with increased rainfall. Through the use of cutting-edge technology and innovative farming techniques, the UAE is working to ensure a more sustainable future in one of the world's most arid regions. However, challenges remain, and ongoing research will be essential to mitigate the potential environmental impacts of these efforts while continuing to develop more efficient and effective solutions for water and food security. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe, and turn on notifications for more captivating content ahead.